people have asked how to slice when they have multiple items they want to slice out of a base item. Now one of the questions recently was to slice multiple items out of letters and she wanted to slice stars out of them. So I have put up my granddaughter's name, Tyler, and I'm going to make this probably as big as I can because it's her birthday shortly. And so I'm going to size that to 11.5 inches in width. Now I'm going to get a little star from the shapes and actually I might not use a star, I might use little hearts because she does like little hearts. So I'll use little hearts. Now I'm going to make this little heart tiny and I'm going to see how tiny I can make them because I want those letters quite as big as I can get. Now I'm going to go over to the layers panel and I'm just going to duplicate that little heart for as many as I can at the moment and I will just put these into the shape of the letters. Put them up here. I may have to go in and make this bigger than a hundred percent to make sure that when I cut these out that I've actually got enough room around the little hearts. And as you can see this little one may have to be a little bit smaller but that one can be fine. And I'm just going to pop these in. This is going to be the bit of the boring part, but if you want to skip down to the rest of the video, it might be easier for you, because this is a long name. So what I'm going to do is put the little hearts in here, and again, if I think they're a little bit big, I will make them just slightly smaller. And if we come over here, I'll just do a few more and put them in. You can always size them as you're going and that will make them really pretty. I'm sure she'll love her name with little hearts in it. And she certainly knows her shapes, so like that. Now as you see I haven't got quite enough to do the rest of it so I'm just going to add a few more down here and put those up there. And we've got two more, so we can put them up there and we'll put one in the middle boat. And oh, we've got another extra one here. Um, maybe what I'll do is I'll put that one down there and I'll put this one over here. Now, I'm going to cut back down to 100% so that we can see the words. And I've actually got a couple of extras there which I'll take off. No, I won't. I'll put them on the Y. Um, so what you're going to do now, or at least what I'm going to do, is I'm going to take the letters and I'm going to take them away. I've put the stars in place. Now I didn't ungroup the letters, so when I click the letters, I can take them away from the stars. Now if you want to cut out or slice all of those you would be doing them all individually because it only slices one object at a time but if we highlight all these or if we uh, highlight them all and then go weld by welding them we're not actually putting them one on top of the other but we're welding them into one image now they are all one image I'm going to put 
the letters back over the top of them and because the stars, the little hearts are now one image, we can highlight both the stars, the, the hearts and the letters and slice will come up over here. We can go slice and once we've gone slice and it's sliced them all out, we can pick up whichever the stars or the letters or the hearts or the letters and we can see that the hearts have sliced their little images out of the letters. Now whether the letters be another icon but that's the way of doing multiple images and slicing them out. Thank you for watching.